Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, it's VMP, and this time, we're playing a little more Fantasy Cal Radio. The Adventures of... Bagnuck. <laughs> the Dwarven Mage, or the Midget Mage, as some of you in the comments have taken to calling him. I guess that works just fine as well. Uh, this is the second episode, and the first episode, we did a lot. I didn't realize that we actually went over to like 50 minutes on the first one, but well, you know what, it was the first episode in the series, that's fine. I'll try to keep it to a more reasonable amount today. Uh, but what we're going to be looking to do today, since we made a ton of money, um, look at it here, through the two tournaments that we won, so we now have 45,000 dinars. So it's time for us to go uh, back down to, what is it, the Wizard Tower, Mage Tower, uh, what's it called? to wizard tower and we're going to hopefully buy some nice uh, mage equipment some new spells some fireball maybe a lightning bolt and then we will be truly a force to be reckoned with right now our, our magic missile spell you know it works on a few people but uh, it's not exactly the strongest spell it's not exactly the strongest so we're gonna work on it a little bit uh, as well as we're doing that we're gonna be stopping in looking at tournaments and the taverns uh, see if we can't find anyone uh, potentially make some more money mountain freeman huh they seem new uh, nope no one in here what about the arena got anyone nice for me or anyone nice i mean <laughs> oh l forest all right good we're right by l forest and another one was nara that's kind of uh i guess it's not out of the way Let's head into Elf Forest, that's fine. Uh, keep our eyes out for any enemies. We have a, wow, 7.7 .7 speed. We are just cruising along here. Uh, looks like we're not going to be able to make it today, but tomorrow, hopefully. Wait outside. Ooh, oh, they did hit us. Sanctimonious Fundamentalists. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, lads. What are we going up against? Oh, they actually seem to be pretty powerful. Fuck. Perfect. Exactly what we wanted. Um. Yeah, that's not the greatest. I have all the faith in our dwarves, but I mean, these guys are pretty good. Oh, whoops. Let's get out of here. These guys are pretty awesome. I feel like we're gonna lose some troops here. Let's help them out. If we can. I like it. She has zero damage. Oh boy. Okay, I think it's time to retreat. We killed a few of them and now we're losing a bunch. Retreat! Yeah, okay, we can run away. All good. All good. We only lost three people. That's fine. I keep on running away. Okay, good. Oh, geez, there's a bunch of them around here. Come on, elves. Get your shit together. <laughs> Uh, what do we got? Oh, come on. Oh, oh, look at some of that armor. Jeez, thick elven royal plate. 62 body armor, 22 leg armor. That's actually amazing, and it only weighs 12 pounds. Oh, I wish. I wish we could. <laughs> oh, what do you got here? Just kind of bows. Yeah, I kind of expected as much. Uh, oh, there's a mage's guild here, though. Let's check this out. What are you here? Oh, they have a bigger circle. Does that mean they're better? <laughs> oh, Galode? Arizair. I welcome you, Bagnuck. Greetings, Master Mage. I've come here seeking your services. I see. What do you need? Uh, oh, spell scrolls. So we can just get them here? Oh, there's not as much. So this guy clearly isn't as bad. Er, as good. He's the Master Mage, while the other one's probably an Arc Mage. Arc Master or something. Uh, there's not really anything I really want here. Hmm. Hmm. No. I think we'll pass. Uh, was there any mage armor in here? No, I didn't think so. Alright, let's just go ahead and join the tournament. And earn a bunch more money, alright? Uh, looks like we're gonna have some good uh, competition here. Of course, these meet, or these uh, tournaments are always like that because we are you know, not exactly the most athletically inclined this playthrough. Ouch. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> I was kind of mad for him hitting us, but uh, he didn't know damage to us. He just, his horse ran over. Oh, she just dodged us. 
Break it down to the ground. Ooh. -hoo. Ugh. Take that. Yeah, make fun of the midget mage now, huh? I'm not so bad with the sword. Ooh, sit down. Oh, Alright, there's one one archer left. Ooh, missed me. Oh, missed me again. Come on. <laughs> We're gonna try to take a knife out, don't they? Oh! I thought she might have had us there for a sec. But nope. We got her. All right, here we go. Four teams of six. Jeez, these are some massive battles going on here. Oh, look at all these archers. Strafe, strafe, serpentine. Wow, we have three. We have four bowmen, three of which are on horses. That's kind of a worthless spot to have the bowmen, but rather than just be on foot. Because when they're on horse, they feel like it's their duty to like charge after the troops instead of just sitting back and firing at them with their bows, which would be the smartest idea. Oh! Oh, wow, we jumped over the horse, but then we couldn't do anything. I was really hoping we could get a kill like that and be pretty awesome. Put that on our on our highlight tape. Ooh. Ooh. What you gonna do with that little knife there? Can you call that a weapon? This is a weapon. Oh, whoops. There's another one left I didn't even realize. Man, our proficiency is going up like crazy. Oh, hello. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's what you get for having a ponytail. <laughs> Rather be bald like a man than have a ponytail. Debatable. <laughs> oh, it's a one on one. What do we go? Oh, and of course we get a bow. At least. Oh, he doesn't have a shield, and we are on a horse, so it should be okay. All right, Twelve damage. So we're not terrible. Fourteen. Another fifteen. Come on. Yeah, down he goes. Yeah, it wasn't bad at all. All right. Oh, uh, three-person free-for-all. No, oh, come on. There we go. Oh, ho, ho! crushed, crushed once again. That that's going on the highlight tape. <laughs> that was that was an obold style move. Oh, we didn't move enough. Oh boy, it does a lot of damage. Just a practice bow. Oh, down you go. <laughs> 44 proficiency in two-handed. That's actually still pretty terrible. <laughs> All right, here's a one-on-one. -on -one. We got oh another archer. That's actually not good. We're gonna charge towards him because <laughs> he's definitely gonna beat us with a bow. He's an elf. I think he's an elf. He might be. <laughs> Why do you keep on backing away after I hit you? Oh! There we go. Oh, that was Kratos. Ah. What a noob. Alright, here we go. Last battle. Who are we going against? Hiru Nuremin Altarior. I guess. I think that's supposed to be a, a vassal. Oh, both got a sword and a shield. I like it. See, Bagnuck hasn't done a lot of fighting, you know, with the uh, with weapons, but he's read up on a lot of the books. You know, he knows the the general strategy, what you're supposed to do. It's just a question of whether he can actually pull it off or not. Which so far he seems to be doing okay. But there we go, another forty one thousand eight hundred dinars. Minus whatever we bet on it, but you know. Oh, and time to flirt with some of the ladies, even though they are taller than him. God that rack though. <laughs> um yeah, we're going to talk to her. Lady Drizvela. You must be Bagnuck. We just had the honor of watching you distinguish yourself in a recent tournament. Now, if you will excuse me... Oh, come on. I, I'd like to dedicate my successes to you. All right, plus four. Okay, so she doesn't mind too much. I'll, uh, actually, wait. We should have probably asked. Daughter and daughter. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. <laughs> um, oh, there's the queen. I'm Bagnuck. Okay. And so we just came here to chill out, and uh, yeah, we don't really belong here, do we? Let's uh, go ahead and get on out of here. <laughs> All right. Well, that was fun. Um, yeah, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get on out of here. Oh boy, dodge everyone. Gotta dodge him. Uh, did our, yeah, our guys did level up. Dwarven champion, and oh, we have a dwarven paragon already. Mm-hmm. Looking amazing. Uh, oh, we leveled up. Some more intelligence. 
And what are we going to spend it in? I guess some more on wound treatment. Yeah, some more wound treatment should be just fine. Fine and dandy. Right, let's level up our weapon proficiencies here. Oh, we have a lot actually to spend. There we go. Um, who's this? On uh, dessert? Ooh, no. Actually, there's just swatting militia. We'd be fine against them. But we are kind of... Have a few of our guys out of order right now. Uh, yeah, so with all the money we have, let's just head straight to Wizard Tower. Because we have, what, 80,000-ish? Yep. 80,793 deniers. Not too shabby. How are we doing on food? We're doing good on food, but let's... Oh, there's a tournament going on over here. You know what? You know what? Let's let's just enter it. Why not? Um, honestly, if we build up a bunch of money now, we're not going to need it later. Um, and actually, hold up. We should be getting, uh, like, buying land all over the place. So let's actually walk around the streets first. Provided Count Clay uh, doesn't, like, hate us for some reason, we should be all right. He hates dwarves. Oh, that's the armsman, I think. Arm seller. Yeah, he's probably up here. Yep, there he is. Guildmaster. Should buy land. There we go. Uh, die works. 569. That's going to be it. There you go. All right. So we'll get some uh, income coming in. Not that we really need it with all the money that we're making, but, you know, never hurts. Later on in the game. Oh. Oh, wow, we have actually have some pretty decent armor on. I forgot that swatting, some swatting tournaments have some really good armor. Actually, have like chain now. Oh, watch out for teammates. Okay, back up. Oh, we're actually gonna get hurt here. We can't block. We can't block. Are oh, we gonna go down here? Yeah, just gotta keep on pressing, keep on pressing. If we can get another kill here, we might be alright. We might not get eliminated, but even then, uh, it's not looking good, guys. It's not looking good. That's why I hate spawning with bows and arrows. Oh, God, come on. Let's keep it. No! Oh. No! Sadness. Sadness. Alright, at least it was just the first round, so we only lost a thousand dinars. Oh well, Bagnock's luck could only go so far. <laughs> I'm not too fussed about that. Oh. Is this new? These castles must be new. The elves, they were not there before. The elves did not have castles down that low, I didn't think. I could be wrong, I guess, but uh, I don't think so. Alright. Keep on heading out. Dang. Oh well. I'm not too fussed. We still have tons of money. Oh. Uh, do you smell that fresh air, brother? This was my home, before I went abroad in search of coin. It's good to be up in the hills again. It's the smell of freedom. This is the Cradle of Rodok Liberty, here under Grunwalder Castle. Oh, uh, you know, sure, let's listen to him. Tell me more. In my father's day, the Swadians would come calling, thinking to make us knuckle our foreheads and call them their overlords. But Grunwalder, an old veteran of the wars from the hills, showed us how to form a battle line with spear and crossbow that could break a Swadian charge. He fell in battle, but the people gave him or gave his name to the castle that was built here where he fell, so that we would remember and always stand firm against the horseman's onslaught. We grow mulberry trees. Well, that kind of took a turn. <laughs> for silk and kerms, too. I'm not sure what a, what a kerm is. Uh, for the dye. I guess some sort of plant that makes dye. <laughs> we take it to Jalakala, where they weave it into the finest velvet. Not that I have ever had enough dinars in my pocket to buy a velvet mine. But the craftsmen of Jalakala also make good crossbows, and for that, I'll not begrudge them their little luxuries. Alright, cool enough. Uh, where are we going? This way. We shall make it to Wizard Tower eventually. Let's, oh, hold up. Let's actually stop in Veluka and buy some more land. I mean, you know, he's talking about they make all this uh, fine 
find stuff here, we might as well uh, get a part of that. Get a share. Alright, who's trying to attack us here? Oh, never mind. <laughs> here I thought someone was trying to attack us because we had our weapons out. I'm, <laughs> I'm out of my mind, guys. Just ignore it. <laughs> ignore me. Wait, no, we were ambushed, right? Yeah, we were definitely ambushed. I, I have no idea. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Here's the guild master. I thought I saw some red script there when we spawned in, so I assumed we got ambushed, but I guess not. Alright, buy land. Velvet. Oh, only 97. That's not economical for me. Um, what about Weebery? 104. No, that's pretty terrible. Uh, linen. Whoops. Linen. 76. Jeez, this is, this is awful. 188. That's still not the greatest. Oil. 344. Not bad, especially because it's pretty cheap. Uh, wine. Ooh, negative 100. Mm -mm. Leather. 205. Ale. 150. Bread. 54. Alright, I guess we're going to go for oil. And I mean, it only costs us 4... 4,500 to buy it, so that's not bad. Alright, that's fine. Plus, we'll save up some money to buy some good equipment uh, once we get into Wizard Tower. Alright, let's head on in. Um, ooh. Rodok Veteran Crossbowman. Yeah, we'll just leave you alone, I think. Would be a smart idea. Oh, wow. Archmage, who is that? Farrard's. With 300 in his party. Nope, not gonna mess with him. Alright, here we go. Enter the Mage's Guild. Let's talk to Master Nafbamas again. <laughs> uh, I'd like to see your spell scrolls. Alright, here we go. What is Missile Storm? The Missile Storm spell was undoubtedly invented by a mage with bad aiming or plain short sightedness. What the spell actually does is create a high number of magical missiles, very similar to those created by the magic missile spell. They will swarm against an enemy or group of enemies, hoping to overwhelm their s shields or kill them with a magical barrage. The higher the caster's level, the higher amount of missiles that will be created. And why not? We're going to buy all the all the uh, expensive ones. So there's that one. Uh, Vampiric Bolt will definitely come in handy. I think, if it does what I think, uh, re represents some of the powers of the dark magic quite well. It creates a dark magic bat that flies against one of your foes. Once the creature reaches one of your enemies, it will hurt him or her and transfer a portion of their health to you. While it may seem that such a creature should be able to fly long distances, in reality, its range is quite limited. 3,000, sure, give it to me. Uh, what up? Oh, no, I didn't, I didn't want that one. I already got that one. I already have that one. <laughs> um, here we go. Uh, let's go. Lightning Bolt. Yep. Want that one. And then we also want Fireball. That should be good. Alright. That'd be enough. How much did we spend? A fair bit. Uh oh, how do I how do I put this into my spell book? Meh. Uh what? How do I Hmm? What's going on here? <laughs> I'm not entirely sure how I put this into my spell book now. Alright, here we go. An expert staff. I think we'll take it for only 5,000. Can afford that. Um, that's pretty decent. Expert robe. Do we, are there expert? No, there's not legs. There's only robes. Okay. We'll spend that. And get the expert hat. Oh, oh hold up. Masterhood. Oh, maybe we want the hood then. Oh, 21,000. Jeez, that's kind of expensive. We would look quite sweet in it, though. Uh, maybe we just want to wait for the Archmage stuff? Let's just get the... Oh. Yeah, you know what? We'll go with the Master. We're, we're, we're letting it fly. We're spending lots of cash. I got a problem with that. Alright, good enough. Um... Can we just wear whatever leg armor then we want, then? We'll, we'll pick this up. It can't be much worse than what we're already wearing. And we'll also... I'll oh, pick up some gauntlets, probably somewhere else. 
Alright, good enough. Well, we actually look pretty decent there now, don't we? Um, the question is, how do we... Hold up, let's take a walk around the streets. See if we can't figure this out. See, no, I can't. Ooh. That looks pretty sweet. But how do I... Hmm. It's kind of annoying. How do I... Huh. Maybe we have to... Take an action? Ah, there we go. That's how we do it. Okay, that's pretty neat. Uh, and... Da, 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 da. There we go. Anything else we might want to do? Not really. Okay, that's good enough. Ah. Uh, is that all the scrolls I had? I, I feel like we bought more than that. Yeah. Spell of Missile Storm. Oh, why can't we... Do we already have that? Why can't we... Are we not good enough to put that in yet? Or... Hmm. I'm not sure why they won't let us use that. I can only assume that we're not high enough level. So we only have a five. That's fine. We have some new spells to play around with and some better equipment to mess around with some people. What the hell? Spawns from hell. Spawn from hell. Hold up. Wait. Spawn from hell have come near... Mija yet to bring death and destruction. What? That didn't sound good. Apparently there's devils now. I think there actually are devils though, if I remember from seeing some of the screenshots from this new version. That'd be pretty sweet to see. Alright, I think we need we need some new troops. Some more troops, not new troops, more troops. So let's head back up to our dwarven uh and dwarven cities over here. Uwo ho. However you pronounce that. And pick up some more dwarves, because they've been doing pretty well so far. They handled themselves pretty well for a little bit against those, uh... What? Sanctimonious fundamentalists? However you... <laughs> however they're called. Um... Oh, how are we doing? How are we doing here? Oh, zombies. Mmm. No. They're a little bit above our pay grade right now. How are we doing on money, actually? Okay. A little low. So, oh, okay, the mages have declared war against Swati. I thought they did that last episode. That must have been against someone else. Now oh, we're traveling the wrong way. If we want to go to Woho, what are we doing? There we go. Yeah, all right, two guys there, not bad. Ah, all right. All right, all right, all right. Okay, you know what? Hey, this could be worse. This could be worse. Um, fireball. No, I'm not allowed to use fireball. I'm not allowed to use magic. Am I not good enough to use it? Is that what's going on? All right. Well, I can use vampiric bolt at least. Oh, wow, that's kind of weird looking. It's kind of hard to hit him with it. Very hard to hit him with it. This could be bad. Whoops. I'm stumbling him a little bit. But then we're getting hurt as well. Charge our staff up. We killed enough of them yet? Probably not. Kill a few more, hopefully. Hey, we killed one. Alright, that should be enough. Let's get out of here. What? Okay, we all of a sudden took a ton of casualties there. That's kind of lame. Yeah, what the hell was that? Why did we take a ton of casualties? That's kind of 
weird. Mountain blade logic for you there. Alright, let's just recruit some more dwarves. That's fine. I think what we just need to do is recruit a bunch of dwarves up. Um, I think I think we need what we need to do is level up a bunch more and increase our power, our magic power, and then we should be able to. Oh, there we go, six dwarves. That's pretty nice. We'll recruit from one more town here. That should be enough. And I think once we level up our magic power a little bit, we should be able to have access to those more powerful spells. Well, at least that's the hope. <laughs> Here we go, some more foot dwarves. Oh, hello. Yeah, we need to watch out. Some of these guys are not fooling around. How are we doing on here in health? We still have not been defeated yet. Still have not been defeated. I just like to point that out. <laughs> I know it's only episode two, and there have been several close call. Oh, there's only 16 shadows. Oh, I want to take them out. Look at all those. Oh, look at all those prisoners they have. 35. Oh, could we do it? I think we'd be able to do it though. Is the thing. Especially if we were to take, if we were to actually use our rusty falcon. Even though we don't have any power strike. Uh, oh, greater shadow warriors. Okay, never mind. There's four of them. That's that's probably not the smartest idea. We'll let them go for now. <laughs> yeah, we're the ones letting them go. They're not letting us go or anything like that. Let's cruise around. Hopefully we can find a smaller party for us to take on. Level our troops back up, and then then we'd be willing to take on maybe some uh, groups like that. Maybe we should uh, join a faction already. Hmm. Oh, yeah, here we go. Twelve looters. Perfect. There we go. This will be a perfect opportunity for us to uh, train up a little bit. Are we charged right now? Discharge. Fireball. Why won't you let us use fireball? Sorry, Not even lightning bolt. We should probably charge our staff back up again. Oh, wow. We crushed him. Right, charge! Yeah! Throw the rocks that you want at me. Woo! Going to town. Mm. Oh, yeah, she blocked us up. Uh, it doesn't appear that we can actually draw our weapon, our falcon. I'm trying to draw it right now, and it won't let me. So maybe mages are restricted to their, um, to using these, their staves. I mean, I suppose that makes sense, but that'd be a little annoying. All right, good enough. Uh, we're not gonna pick up that crap. We have plenty of money and those pennies aren't gonna make it much of a difference. All right, Dwarven Paragon, nice. Um, yeah, let's look for another group like that. Maybe even some Sea Raiders. I think our dwarves would be okay against some Sea Raiders, even though we do still have some regular dwarves that we wanna level up into foot dwarves. Oh, there we go, the Sea Raiders will come to us and they're, oh, 21 of them, okay. All right, guys, we'll be fine. Charge our staff up. Alright, this direction apparently. Oh wait, the Sea Raiders are very... Their ranged weapons kill us. Ooh! I got a couple guys on horseback. They're not ready for this electric... Oh! Jeez! You need to get on my level. Oh, I was gonna say we only threw one that one time. I was like, "What? We're definitely a better mage than that." There we go. Killed him.
<laughs> we are not doing anything against these guys, really. There we go. Oh boy. Wow. Yeah, some of our regular dwarves are going to get killed here, but that's to be expected. Well, we're trying to level them up into actually decent units. I'm not too fussed about that. There we go. It would be nice if we could get some mages. Hmm. Might actually have to go do that. Go recruit at some of the mage towns. I think that might actually be a smart idea. Now we lost uh, a couple dwarves, a couple foot dwarves. But they're leveling up into dwarven fighters. There we go, that's fine. Actually, a pretty decent party we just fit. Oh, wow, look at this armor. There we go. Oh, and we leveled up. Nice. Let's talk to Bunduck and get him to get some of this good equipment. There you are. There you are. Um, forget that pickaxe. Use. I guess use this thing. No, I want you one-handed with a shield. There we go. And, oh, here's some good boots for you. Actually, some good boots for me, and you can have these. You can have the rusty ones. Alright, that's good enough, I think. Yeah, neither of us have any gauntlets. That's fine. Alright, now let's have us level up. Some more intelligence, and some more magic defense, and power. Um, let's level up our pole arms. That's what we really need here. Alright, there we go. So yeah, let's start heading down to the mage t uh, towns again. Because that's where we always... That's where we reach our advantage is when we have a bunch of mages that just blow up incoming troops. And hopefully now... Where are we? I don't like us being out of view. That makes me nervous. Because I can't see incoming enemies. Uh, <laughs> like we've already done at least twice this episode run into huge massive groups that we can't attack or t can't stand a chance against um, but yeah so we need a bunch of mages that can just sit back and you know blow enemies up with fireballs I'm kind of confused as to why we can't use the fireballs ourselves but like I said I think that's just something to do with the fact that we are a low level still we're only a level 7 yeah, we're only level 7. Jeez. Normally we'd be like a level 12 at this point, but we're not melee related, so we're not really getting as much experience as normal. And just because we can't kill as many troops, because the mages are weaker on in the beginning. Um, I think I do think we'll slowly get stronger, though. And... Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright. I'm going to lose 4 troops. That's fine. Because we would not have stood a chance against those guys. I need to I need to keep on paying attention. God, oh man, there are so many large parties around here. Oh, oh, look at these guys. See, now if we still had those four troops, I'd say we take them on and and we'd fairly easily destroy them. But we don't have those troops anymore. I think we'd be okay against them, but. And to be honest, the troops they have aren't exactly the greatest. Most of them are forest bandits, so I'm not too fussed about that. But that would have been nice. Alright. We just need to get some mages. Just need to get some, some decent mages. Get them up and rolling, and we'll be fine. We're good to go. Sit back. And let the magic happen. Quite literally. <laughs> let the magic happen. Oh, see. Not our various investments are bringing in money for us oh no one wants to join us okay well, that's, that's lovely let's go over to Eriwick then see if they want to join us there we go two novice mages I like how they just have entire villages of mages yeah, they don't have farmers or you know blacksmiths or anything like that they're all just mages what do they practice <laughs> Oh, well, Count Talrog, don't you have a pretty terrible army there? It's only 24. 
Oh, here we go. Six mages. Nice. That'll definitely help out. And you know what? Let's get some more. Why not get some more? We have the money. And we have the food. There we are. Alright, let's head into Wizard Tower. And sell off some stuff here. Oh, that's... Wait, what? Oh, we only have an expert staff. We don't have a master staff? What? Should we get... No, we're not gonna... No, we won't get that. We'll wait for an Archmage uh, staff to pop up. And we'll wait for us to get some more money, of course. That would help as well. Here's the master hat. We have a master hood. See, that would have looked, that looked cooler, but nope, it was not available at the time. Oh, thick male mittens would actually give us a decent amount of... Oh. Mm. That's tempting. We'll wait for us to win another tournament first, though. And actually, looking at the time here, I think it's about time we wrapped it up. So, uh, an okay episode this time. We definitely got equipped with a bunch of new stuff. Um, that's actually, so let's take a walk around the streets and see if we can't use some of this magic now. So they will let me throw these. Good. Lightning bolt? No. No lightning bolt. I'm going to have to look this up and see what's going on there. Fireball? No. But they will let me throw the vampire bolts. Or the vampire bats. Hmm. Seems like it's, these are going to be hard to aim, really. But maybe it just doesn't tell you when you actually hit. Not too sure about that. Uh, but there you go, guys. So uh, things are looking up. Looking good. We have a bunch of novice mages, 13 of them. Uh, some of them shall hopefully make it all the way up into, you know, expert mages, master mages, who knows. Uh, a lot of them will probably die along the way, but you know, it, that happens. Things happen, right? <laughs> Um, but as always, guys, uh, leave me some comments down below. Let me know what you think about the series. Um, I will be gone for Saturday and probably most of Sunday this weekend, so I'm not going to be able to record that. So I'm going to try to get another episode uh, recorded and uploading today, which is Friday. So hopefully you guys will have a couple episodes for the weekend. Uh, I've been really busy, so I apologize about that, but... Um, gonna do my best to keep them coming out for you and possibly a new series soon but uh, i won't say too much about that and just have to wait and see so as always guys take it easy